Nobody moves like that. Not a single third baseman in baseball tippy toes to catch the fucking ball. It's like they brought a guy in to do animations for fielders and he's just tippy toes and everyone at the studio's like, uh, hey, what the f is that guy doing? And then the other guy goes, I don't know, but I like it. We should put it in the game. Hey, what's up, dude? Joe Carter debut. I'm not gonna go over his stats because you already know his stats, but uh, they're pretty good. We also have a Nick Madrigal debut. Again, his stats, really good as well, except for the hitting. Well, the power. He can hit great, but no power. We're gonna start Roy Oswalt in this game. I mean, look at the stats, man. It's crazy good. Um, hopefully I don't f it up. Chicago Pearl Gang, low Keezy. We're going up against Kluber. I don't know how I feel about that yet, we'll see. Tatis, Moncada, Bellinger, Baez, Soto, Judge, Mondesi, and uh, again, like usual on this channel, I didn't catch the last one, because I don't read quick enough. 23 and 13 record for the uh, Pearl Gang. I'm not really sure what a Pearl Gang is. I'm sure that's what they're discussing right now. He's like, I don't have no f***ing clue what it is, man. You know, is it something sexual? Okay, well, that's the first pitch of the game, and that's a base hit. I feel like Todd Helton, you know, probably should have uh, made more of an effort. But I'm learning something about the fielders in this game, man. They uh, are always at the minimal effort level. Oswald. Here you go. Make this play. Redeem yourself. Does it not redeem you? I was kidding. I'm still pissed at you. We get him uh, swinging on a pitch that he had no business swinging on. I don't want to talk too much shit because I do that all the time. But at the same time, I'm a shit talker, so what a f***ing idiot. Strike. Oh, no. Oh, no. That is disgusting. The ball got hit down the third base line, and my third baseman's like, oh, shit, that's, that ball's far away. What a good pitch. What a good pitch. There's nothing worse than uh, it's saying mid first and you're down by more than one run. Curtis Granderson leading things off with a 304 average. Well, it's probably like 300 now. I'm not good with math. Todd Helton gives it a ride. But it just died, man. There's no power behind that. That was like swinging a pool noodle. A dry one. I'm behind on sinkers. Yeah, three sinkers in a row. I'm behind on every one of them. Sometimes I forget I'm recording and I don't react to strikeouts. See? There we go. Reacted to that one. Sit down, idiot! We are losing, though. Joey Gallo at the plate, batting 182. I'm gonna have to change that, man. This guy's throwing a lot of balls, though. So I'm gonna have to lay off this one. Oh, come on. Right to him. Glaber Torres, come on, man. You are the guy. You're my guy. You idiot! Nick Madrigal at the plate. First at bat. And I just realized that I didn't even announce Joe Carter's at bat. Totally forgot about it. So Joe Carter has already had an at bat in his debut that I was paying no attention to. Out number three. Uh oh. Okay. When I hit the ball, I think it's gone and it, it doesn't go anywhere. When he hits the ball, I think it's gone. And it doesn't go anywhere. I'm not sure if what I just said made any sense. I'll have to find out when I edit the video. Have a seat, pal. God, I'm getting him to swing at everything. Check this out. Okay, we're out of the inning. Buster Posey, don't mess this up. The guy worries me, man. Inning number three, and I need a hit. That's not a hit. Too slow. Buster Posey at the plate, batting 231. This would be a great time to get on my good side. I try, man. I try and try and try to like this Buster Posey card. Well, that sucks, man. I'm sorry that happened to you, but uh, it literally happens to every one of us. Curtis Granderson. Oh, no. Behind on a sinker. Oh, come on, man. What a pitch. There we go. Strikeout number 12. Juan Soto is not very fast. I don't know why that's the first thing that popped into my head. It should have been like, hey, man, make the play. But I, I was so convinced that there was a possibility that I, that guy was going to mess up the play. My first thought was, oh, he's not that fast, so maybe we'll have two chances. 
Right up the middle. God damn it. Oh, shit! Man! Oswald! You're f***ing up your ERA, dude! Did you not know you had a below one ERA? There's no way it's below one anymore. What are you doing? Out number three. Down by four. And I haven't even got a hit yet. Oh, wait. I did get a hit. With my pitcher. I will no longer be behind on any sinkers or fastballs. I wasn't behind on that. I f***ed it up, but I was not behind on it. Sad times, man. Sad times. I'm glad I'm the only one in this room. Joe Carter! At the plate. I'm just swinging away. Man. Come on, Gallo. Three. Tried to lay off of a, a pitch there. He hit the corner. Does not surprise me. Fielding is so annoying this year. It's little things too, like like get locked in animations earlier than you would expect it to happen. And it makes you feel like if he wouldn't have got locked into that animation, I might have actually been able to get to that ball. Oh my God, come on, man. Perfect. There's no way he's going to be able to lay off this. Told you. Don't fucking look at me, dude. Do not fucking give me attitude right now. Okay. Could have just stepped on third base, but I threw it to second. Down by four. One hit to his seven hits. This is a bad one, dude. This is not what I wanted to happen. Okay, early on the changeup. That means I'm sitting fastball, which is what I need to do with this guy, I think. Come on, Glaber. This guy thinks he's so cool, man. We need to knock him off his pedestal. That was a good pitch. Nick Madrigal making his second plate appearance on the team. We, of course, damn it. We, of course, pulled him out of the headliner pack we opened uh, yesterday. Oh, boy. If he would have had a shift on, I would have been a double. That's all I'm saying. Gotta look at the bright side. You know, live in a fantasy world. It's, it's just easier. Crush that one. Hey, he finds a hole. Buster Posey now. Come on, man. Come on, Buster. Buster does not find a hole. Got he finds an enemy. Got two hits, though. So, looking on the bright side. Hmm. I knew that was going to happen. I hung the shit out of that ball. It finally happened, man. Oswald is getting crushed. Nobody moves like that. Nobody. Not a single third baseman in baseball tippy toes to catch the fucking ball. Uh-oh. It's like they brought a guy in to do animations for fielders for pop flies and he's just tippy toes. And everyone at the studio is like, uh, hey, what the f*** is that guy doing? And then the other guy goes, I don't know, but I like it. We should put it in the game. And the other guy's like, yeah, we should definitely put it in the game. You know what else we should do? Let's f*** up the fielding. What a hit. What a hit. Getting to that point where we're going to have to take out. I'm hanging out. I'm hanging all sorts of shit. We're going to have to take out Oswald here pretty soon. Probably let him finish the inning. But I shouldn't. But I will. And we are out of the, uh, out of the inning. Bringing in Willie Stargell to pinch hit for the pitcher spot. We definitely need to get something going now. Curtis Granderson, two strikeouts. He's out. Oh man, look what I did on that one. Tell me how that happens. Todd Helton. All right, Eck, do your thing, bud. Everyone seems to have confidence in you. I mean, but honestly, if Buster Posey has faith in you, that's not a good thing because he also has faith in himself and he can't do shit. So take it with a grain of salt, Dennis. What a pitch. What a pitch. Here we go. Time to get some runs, man. Time to get some runs. Time to get some hits. Joe Carter, he's 0 for 2, but a lot of people are 0 for 2 on this team right now. So he's fitting right in. Down the line, right to the defender. If I was the first baseman, I would prefer to be called the defender instead of the first baseman. Gallo. Triple. Glaber right into the gap. That's going to score a run. Hey, we got a run. Look at that. Nick Madrigal. Also 0 for 2. 
And Nick Mac. Oh. It looked like it was elevated. No, he's in there. I wish it would have been. You know, we're gonna lose. I know that. But uh, by how much? That's the question. God damn it, what a pitch. I know, right? Sit down, tall motherfucker. Mondesi hits it right to uh, our left fielder. Which I don't recall who that is. Who the fuck? Oh, Joey Gallo. Whoops. We got to go Yelich, man. We got to bring in Yelich right here. Jumpstart this offense, please. I'll put you back on the team, I promise. Zach Britton, perfect. Hopefully he gives me something over here so I can just knock it down that third base line. Oh, okay. Whatever, I'm not, I don't care. Another lefty at the plate. Doing nothing. Well, I guess if there was ever a game to give uh, old Rickster Ghost some innings, it would be this game. And I'm just gonna put him right in. Cold as ice. Aye. Good Lord. And I need strikeouts with my no, old uh, Rickster no, Ghost character. That way we can get him to a diamond. And he will be worthy. He's already worthy, to be honest with you. He's uh, my favorite on the whole team. Nothing biased. Aye. Oh, my goodness. When did you become so filthy? Good Lord. All-star caliber pitcher right there, man. Rickster Ghost coming in, striking out the side. I am losing, though. Last chance. Ninth inning. Look at me go. That's a good hit, though. There we go. Todd Helton. Right over the first baseman's head. Do I sense a ninth inning comeback? Okay. Let's just get it over with at this point. I'm going to swing at everything he throws. There we go. The game's over. And I lost by a lot. I had my best pitcher in. And then, uh, you know, in my head, I'm like, okay, we're going to start Roy Oswalt. He's got a .74 ERA. That means we're going to get a win. I could have started Kluber. He was at full energy too, but I went with Oswald because I wanted the guaranteed win, which we did not get at all. Not even close. We got crushed by the uh, Pearl Gang. Still have no idea what that means. I'm going to Google it though. I'm starting to think it means something sexual though. It just sounds sexual. Pearl Gang. Or maybe it's just a bunch of bitches named Pearl that cause ruckus in the neighborhood. I don't know. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. If you're new here and you enjoyed it, hit the subscribe button, you know? If you're not new here, I appreciate you watching as always. Make sure you hit those bell notifications so you don't miss just amazing debut videos. You know, amazing debut videos. Really top-notch gameplay.